In this video, guys, I'm gonna show you how you can get free yardage in Madden 23 using something I like to call the flash pass. Now, first things first, when executing the flash pass, well, let me break down what it is first things first. Um, it's going from a compression set, motioning one of your guys out, whether it be a wide receiver or whether it be a tight end in this situation, in this formation, that you can motion out and snap the ball while before he gets set while he's still in motion. Using that type of motion and just snapping the ball when you push those guys out and then just reading the defense and making a quick throw if you get the read that you want. So it's very good against cover three. It's, it's really a cover three, cover four buster. But you also have options against cover two as well as man coverage, which I'm gonna get into later in the video, which is why you need to watch until the very end. Now, as you guys can see, it's a cover three on defense. Now, what route you guys use with this flash pass? Like, you'll step the ball as he before he gets all the way out and just hike throw the ball. Get your read after you hike the ball. And then if you get the proper read, which I'm gonna show you guys right now, just quick pass this ball to this band. So when you motion him out, as soon as you snap the ball, all you're looking for is you're looking for this guy to step backwards. That's the only read for this. Because this guy, he's too far inside to be able to make a play on this ball. And plus, if it's a cover three, he's got to be kind of held up by this inside route as well. But um, yeah, he's too far inside to make a play on this ball right here. Like I said, you're only reading this outside guy. Steps back, deliver the ball. Quick pass, get your way up the field. Now, from this play that I'm running right here, it's the four verticals play. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna show you guys why I'm running this play a little bit later. But you can run this with any type of route on the outside. A curl route, which I'm gonna get to later as well. You guys can see the curl route works. I'm gonna take a look at the, at the out route. Got your read, deliver the ball. Works all the same. An uh, in route. Hey, John, John. Works all the same, baby. I actually threw that ball a little late. But you want to uh, lead pass this ball kind of up into the outside. Up into like the 11 o'clock, 1 o'clock range, if you will. I got, I got this. Hey, so, that's a pretty easy breakdown for if you got like a cover three. Now... Let's take a look against cover two, Tampa two specifically. 11, 11, 11. Now I'm gonna show you guys what this looks like when you snap the ball. I'm gonna show you guys what to go with, where to go with this ball. So look how this guy reacts. He goes back, but he's really slow playing it. He's not really going back the way the cover three guy went back. So he's not like really committing to going back. Now let's go back to this cover three real quick so you guys can see the difference. Now cover three is on the field right here. Look at the difference. He's jetting back there. Now I just, the ball just got tipped away. But see the difference between the way the cornerback reacted. Snap the ball, he's booking it. He's backpedaling his way up out of there. Now let's go back to this cover two. Tampa two. Similar thing if it's hard flats as well, but as you can see, foul flats, he's slow playing it. Let's just look at this guy. He's slow playing it. He's got, he's not in a hurry. So you're really looking for that guy, that cornerback, to get up out of there. Now let's take a look at hard flats for cover two. Now he's just up in your grill. He is in your face. Now whether you get either of those two reads. The reason why I like this four verticals play, let's go back to the cloud flats. You look at him on the outside, you, it's, you, you can figure out his cloud flats right away, and you just throw the ball up the scene. That's why I really like this four verticals play. It's probably the best base play just to come out in this and just run this basic flash pass like mini scheme from. Get a similar thing. If you got cover two of hard flats, you're just looking at the outside corner. Oh, he's in his face. He's in his face. Didn't get the best of throws. Still was a touchdown. But you actually, if it's a cover two hard flats, you actually get the read that it's a hard flat. 
Just wait till he passes. It's wide open as well. And I'm gonna show you guys that right now. So cover two is really just it's it's dice though. It's dice up. As you can see, cover two hard flats. Oh, you see him jump up, you see him jump up. Just wait for him to pass. Easy completion. It's free yardage, guys. It's free yardage. Like I mentioned, you can throw other routes on the field with this flash pass. Like I said, you can do a curl. You can do an in route. You can do an out route. But let's talk about this curl real quick. That same read. Oh, I still got the in route on there. Still got the in route. My bad, guys. My bad. Run the curl. Motion mouse side. Same read. That's why I like this curl as well. So you can do the flash pass if it's zone coverage, but if you get a read, so when you get man coverage, as you guys can see, he's stepping up. He's kind of staying like where he's at and stepping up, playing it slow, very slowly, but he's not backpedaling it slowly like he was in the cover two or with the cloud flats. So that's how you know it's man coverage, guys. So you automatically know at this point right here, Ball snapped. At this point, you already know you cannot throw the flash pass because he's all the cornerback has stepped up. Now, you by the way he's playing, you can diagnose it's man coverage. Now you can put other routes on the field if you guys wanted to, but I already know this curl route beats man coverage. So go ahead, throw the nice little curl route in this. So you can do the flash pass. It allows you to set up different types of plays. So Let's say you really like, I'm just going to motion this guy out just so you guys can just get the, the, the idea. Let's say you just really like the aspect of what's going on with, um, again, zone coverage on the left side of the field. But let's say you want some man beaters if you want to have other options on the right side of the field. You can run a curl. You can run an out or a drag by this guy or in route or whatever. Whatever you want to do. But you read the flash pass. Follow me, guys. Follow me. Snap the ball. Bam. You read the flash pass. If it's not there, you know you have other places to go with the ball. You already know the flash pass is going to be up against cover three. If it gets cover two, you're going to have an option between B and X. If it's man coverage, you can shift your eyes to the right side of the field, get that curl action, get that drag action. This is how you build your other routes around this flash pass. And you can do something like that. Now, or you could do something like, like I mentioned earlier, have that curl route, which will be your answer against man coverage in one way, or you can run RB on an out route as well. You can read X and then RB, or you can put RB on a drag route. Do you still have to flash pass read with X, and then X is still read on man coverage as well you got other routes to work in as well so and that's just one aspect of it guys think about when you motion this other tight end out work start working flash pass action with this tight end same rules still apply it's the same exact thing you just got a tight end instead of a wide receiver that's why i really love this single back wing flex close formation a scheme is I'll, it's deadly guys but i just want to show you guys the flash pass um it's actually available from pretty much any formation that has compressed wide receivers or tight ends that you can motion this compressed guy out and still snap the ball before he gets set it's available in every single formation that you can do that so you can take this idea and just scheme around it Matter of fact, send me your ideas of what you come up with. I'd be glad to showcase it to the world. I appreciate you guys for watching my videos. WF, I'm out.